This is live with more on the Shop Bot Workshop. Hello. Good morning. Okay, so today we're hanging out at the Hacker Lab here in Rockland. This place is so cool. You can get to learn so many things by coming out here. Um, but today we are actually talking to Roger because he's going to tell us a little bit about CNC router. Right. And this is a really cool machine. I know everybody loves the DIY things now. Sure. So they want to make their own creations, especially for their homes. So why not do something with wood? So this is what you have here for us today. And that CNC router what is that exactly Roger so it's really just like a handheld router if you've ever used one of those it's a motor with a cutting bit in it this is a good example of a V bit that you can use in a handheld router or mm -hmm. in our case the bit is being held by a computer numerically controlled machine that's a CNC router so CNC just means computer numerically controlled uh, and you can use it to make all kinds of these different uh, designs you see in front of you here yeah uh, uh, this is an emblem we made for Police Officers Motorcycle Association. As one example, uh, we have a couple people here make commercial signs, things mm -hmm. like that, who've learned from us. Uh, some 3D carvings. This lion, for example, is a really nice emblem uh, that you can put on children's furniture, things like that. Yeah. Uh, nice thing about it is we offer classes on all of these things. We don't assume you know anything about it. Uh, I specifically learned CNCs here uh, at, at the Hacker Lab. Lab. Uh, that was a while ago, uh, mm -hmm. and I've been uh, I've been a woodworker for about 50 years yeah. as an electronics engineer. I'm a retired electronics engineer. Okay. Uh, but this has been bringing my passions together, both computers and uh, making things. So. Yeah, and by the way, this is his retired job. So he loves what he does. So this is the best. This is the best way to have a teacher right here. But Roger, if you can get up with me, so we can show folks. Okay. So basically, you start with a blueprint right there on the screen and uh, through a program, and then it turns out into these beautiful pieces right over here but first it goes to that machine that I was telling you about earlier and that's the one that we're talking about the router so what it does is it cuts the wood and it, it's all up with the blueprint that you have on the computer so Roger do you want to sure. make it go Okay, and by the way, this is just so cool because you don't have to be someone who's really interested in wood shop and woodworking. Really, you can just be someone like me and who's just interested in learning some new things. And you were talking a little bit earlier about how people actually utilize this to make gifts we for do, their employees. Yeah. For super cheap, too. Super cheap, uh, real busy around here around the holiday times. People have been making gifts for family, friends, employees, uh, can save a lot of money and has that nice handmade look to them or handmade. Yeah. Uh, people really appreciate it when you actually make something for them as opposed to just going out and buying it. Yeah. And, uh, and you can actually usually save quite a bit of money doing that as well. I agree. You know, so. Completely. Okay, so we're going to wrap it up here, folks. I need to go and check out how to make something really nice for Tina and Ashley to Please. show my appreciation of my love for these <laughs> lovely ladies. Oh. So I'll toss it back to you. You know, Sabrina, I'm trying to make the backyard look good for, you know, the nice weather. So something from